Museveni, the president of Uganda, actually once said, the guy earns more than the country earns from tea. <laughs> so he earns more than the country of Uganda earns from tea and coffee. Hi, what's up guys? Ah, so today you're doing something, I, I saw this article somewhere, of the man who owns half of Kampala. He's also known as the Lord of Kampala. And the name is actually Sudhir Ruperelia. And he is worth $1.1 billion. Though it, can, it goes up and down. He was actually in 2014 Forbes as one of the richest guys in Africa. He's worth an estimated $1.1 billion. And his background is that he is actually born in 1951. And he is the chairman of the Ruperelia group of companies, which has interest, of course, in real estate, education, interest, and your typical uh, African uh, rich man who owns everything and everything in each and every sector of their society. But uh, he, was, um, he was quoted saying uh, that most guys actually said, this is actually his actual quote. He was saying, um, I don't own half of Kampala, some of those reports are grossly overrated. That is well. However, this is what we do know. He owns at least 300 real estate properties in Kampala. So he owns 300 properties in Kampala. Plus, one of those buildings, properties, is actually a 70-acre uh, called the Spec Hotel uh, in Kampala. So, yes, when you say the guy owns half of Kampala, it's actually, might not be half of it, but actually visually makes sense. His properties, get this, I mean people, so he earns an estimated $400 million per year from his real estate property. Museveni, the president of Uganda, actually once said, the guy earns more than the country earns from tea. <laughs> <laughs> so he earns more than the country of Uganda earns from tea and coffee. You know what I mean? That is just okay, anyway. Uh, so let's just uh, do a bit of let's okay. This is a real estate channel, so guys. So what is there? So Sudhil um, started buying properties from 1981. Uh, to current, he actually says uh, some of those properties used to buy them for fifty thousand dollars, and now some of them are worth 12 million dollars uh, he actually said he used to he used to buy a building and it would take four to five years from paying the from the rent that he got to actually get his money back what's the connection to kenya perelia's fortune started when he actually had saved enough money twenty-five thousand dollars to be specific so he starts importing sugar and salt from kenya right Graduates to importing beverages from the East African villages to Uganda, then graduates to properties, and as you know, uh, the rest is history. That guy is a billionaire. Um, but one of the funny, the funny thing is that, that just to give you an essence of how rich this guy is, he actually owns the building which houses the Ugandan parliamentarians. Yeah, that's rich, man. Anyway, guys, uh, thank you for coming for our channel coming back we do real estate we talk about everything and anything real estate uh, as long as it can inspire you or be helpful or entertaining as well it's good so uh, click on the uh, a video here or here about something about nairobi real estate you can really enjoy it as well goodbye <laughs>